Hi guys and welcome back to another what I eat in a week video. I just finished getting ready because I'm going to be going grocery shopping for the week. I'm wearing this Ralph Lauren sweater that I got from ThreadUp. I'm so obsessed with it. It's so cute. And then these jeans are from Fashion Chingle. And then I have my tote bag which is from my merch collection. I can't believe I can like finally wear this out and you guys can also match with me. So I'm at Umomo right now and I forgot my camera at home. I'm actually so stupid. I have to just film on my phone and my GoPro. Came back home and i'm so mad at myself because i left my camera at home so i had to film all the footage on my phone but i can't believe i left my camera in my room like that was the first time that i ever forgot to bring my camera out today was just like really hectic but as i was saying i only got like four hours of sleep last night so i'm like super tired right now i'm gonna do a quick little umomo haul umomo is this like japanese store it's basically like a daiso i only got two things i got these hair clips thought they were really cute and i like the checker design can't see it well and then i got this dorimo snack So I wanted to give a huge shout out to ThreadUp for sponsoring this portion of the video. I personally love shopping, especially online, and ThreadUp is super convenient for that because it is basically online thrifting. So ThreadUp is an online consignment and thrift store with super affordable prices. It's super easy to use because you can sort the items by brand or you can manually search up what you're looking for. So here are some of the items that I chose from ThreadUp. So first I have this Argyle sweater, and Argyle is actually one of my favorite prints when it comes to clothing items. So I actually just searched up argyle on the search bar and thread up showed me so many different options so i found this really cute argyle sweater from saint john's bay next i have this cable knit sweater from ralph lauren and this is definitely my favorite purchase from thread up because i've actually been looking around for cable knit sweaters from ralph lauren for such a long time but i found this on thread up which is such a steal because the estimated retail price is 128 dollars but i got this for 21.99 on thread up which is such a good deal so i basically saved 106 dollars on this sweater which is insane and i also wore this previously in the video and then with this ralph lauren sweater i paired it off with these shorts that i also got from thread up and they are originally from levi's they are these low-rise gray shorts the estimated retail price is 90 dollars, but i got them on thread up for 17.99 and i also have another cable knit sweater from ralph lauren but this one is a v-neck and it's also navy blue which is one of my favorite colors when it comes to clothing items lastly i have this dress from urban outfitters as you guys know urban outfitters is like known for for their really expensive prices so it's really cool to see that thread up offers urban outfitters as well so you guys can get 30 percent off your first order and free shipping using my code serangho you guys should definitely check out thread up i will have the link in my description box down below it is a great way to save money and live sustainably
So I'm having Bulunji Samba, but this plate is so cute and it's perfect for spring. And then I also have some Gurtok. I also got these chopstick holders yesterday from Umomo and it's like a peppermint candy. Again, it's so cute. I'm gonna have this pear drink today. I don't know how I'm gonna fit this in one bite. So I just finished eating, but I'm gonna be going out with a friend right now. So I got home pretty late today, but before I remove my makeup and like brush my teeth, I'm gonna have the Targona that I got today. I changed out of my outside clothes into my merch. I literally got like the most random things today. I got this white mask pack. Oh, I literally can't use my fingers anymore. I mean, my hands. As you guys saw earlier, I got my nails removed, my biogel nails, and I just have my bare nails for the first time in so long i think the last time i had like my bare natural nails was like december i didn't let my nails breathe for that long as you can see they look so weak and they are i feel like there's like literally one layer of nail i literally can't open this because my nails hurt and then i got this targona candy it was at checkout so i just got it i know squid games like a long gone trend but i just love Targona, which is also called Boki. I always used to get these on the streets in Korea when I was younger. So it like makes me really nostalgic and I just love how they taste. I got the umbrella shape. What am I doing? It's literally 3.20 a.m. and I'm eating basically a chunk of sugar, burnt sugar. Mm. It is the next day and I just took a shower because my hair was so greasy. So I feel refreshed now and I'm gonna go eat. We're going to be making three different types of dumplings. I'm also going to be making this tea that my friend got me from Vietnam. As you guys know, I love tea and I prefer it over just like regular water. I'm having homemade mandu and I have three different types. This is fried dumplings. This is bur mandu, which is basically water dumplings. And then here I have jim mandu. Mm. I'm going to try the steamed dumpling first. dumplings this is actually so good this 
so I just woke up from a nap. It's 9 p.m. so I'm gonna be eating some dinner. For dinner today, I'm having cheese tonkas. I also have some instant udon. The plating is so pretty. Everything's pink themed. I also have ramune for my drink. My favorite flavor for this drink is peach. I'm starting off my day with doku and my mom added the dumplings that we made yesterday For side dishes, I have kosari and kimchi and then I also have kimchi ojingo chan We're having more of the chan because it was so good and my mom just made like a huge one I'm gonna be eating dinner now. I just finished doing my nails. They're nail strips, so I didn't actually paint them These are the cutest little plates. We got them from Umomo. For dinner, I'm having hemertang and it has a lot of different seafood. For my side dishes, I have kimchi, gozari, hobakbukum, and seaweed. The colors and everything are so pretty. For my late breakfast today, I'm having udon and yubuchubap with different toppings. Mm. 
I'm trying the avocado one now. Mmm. I finished all of them except for the egg one, but I don't really like egg. Lemon man, come to catch it. Hold on, my lad. I have an exam in exactly an hour now. Um, <laughs> I forgot to mention, but this week is my finals week. I'm done school for this year, so I'm done my first year of university. That's why I haven't been going to school or any classes in this video. But yeah, I have three exams this week, and then I already had one last week. And then I have Korea to look forward to in summer, so I'm so excited. So I just finished my exam and now I have two left but I just finished doing my makeup for some reason my lashes curled really well and I usually always have bad lash days it's really late now it's 10 18 p.m. I had my exam at 7 p.m. so it was at like a really random time usually exams are like earlier <laughs> For dinner today, I'm having Pyeonijeom style mukbang food, which is basically Korean convenience store food. Here I have Prudak Dopoki, Spaghetti, and then Samgak Kimbap, banana milk, some roll cake, Hapa, which is like a fish cake stick, and then a Korean hot dog. This is what the Prudak Dopoki looks like. I actually managed to eat a lot of the food, but now I'm gonna have some roll cake. I'm having ganjangguksu and chadorbaegi. I also have some musam and lettuce to eat with the chadorbaegi. And then this is a cucumber side dish.
For dinner today, I'm having sundubu and there's also clam inside. And then for side dishes, I'm having oimuchim, bean sprouts, kozari, and there's also shrimp that was left over. And then this is fried sausage with egg. Yeah, everything looks so good. I'm gonna try the egg now. I can't tell if it's like cooked properly, but I love like runny yolks. That was literally like a raw yolk, but it was still really good. I'm having seconds now. I also added another egg, and now the egg is like too cooked. I woke up really late today because I was editing all night yesterday, but I'm gonna go eat. I'm having kimchi fried rice with cheese and egg and I also have kimchi marikuksu Ano? I'm gonna have some hemmer pajon first and chon is actually one of my favorite Korean dishes. It's so good. For dinner today, I'm having tunggarbi kimchi jjim and I also have some more chon. I hate getting my hands dirty when I eat, so I'm wearing a glove. I'm always drinking this because it's so good. For dessert, I'm gonna be trying this chocolate fondue set. You basically just put the chocolate here and then I have strawberries to dip into the chocolate. I'm gonna be using this chocolate. The chocolate's all melted now. Sorry for the sudden ending, but thank you for watching and just a reminder that you can get 30% off your first order on ThreadUp with my code Serango.